Hi. Um, I have kind of a larger context question. So I don't know how much you can do or the California State Senate can do about this, but when you talk about housing and the environment and all these things, California is getting, San Francisco Bay Area is getting 30,000 people a year moving here, and California is getting hundreds of thousands. There's just, it's not possible to build our way out of because supply and demand doesn't wait. Supply and demand. developers and for high income, I mean, <laughs> even for affordable housing. But my question larger than that is, is that like instead of pulling more people to California, drought state with environmental issues, how, is there any way that you can do things like encourage the major companies that are here, both in agribusiness and tech, to spread the wealth, to go to places that have housing, where we can yeah. set up hubs and spread and spread the wealth like across the country. Like there are places that could use growth, that could use that, the places near universities that have qualified people that would love to reinvest in their areas. Now I realize this is not just a local question, but my question is, is there something that California as a state, as you and legislator, can talk about? Cha you know, we lead in discussions about things. Can we start that? So, first of all, excuse me. Um, uh, on your first point about supply and demand, and I'll find out, I, I respect your position on it, I don't agree. Um, and we've seen actually a uh, concrete example. <laughs> Seattle, it's happened in Washington, D.C., there are some cities that have significantly ramped up their housing production and have seen rents go down. Uh, and so, uh, you know, uh, we, well, we have a situation uh, where we're, again, producing one housing unit for every eight jobs we had, and, you, and then you see housing prices goes up, go up. I think that's sort of proof in the pudding that it is about we don't have enough supply to meet demand. But in terms of the demand, uh, so, you know, two things. There's a, the people, Part of it and the job. That's some of the people are part of it. When I, we, the answer is no. We, we don't, government is not in the business of deciding where people can uh, People can move wherever they want to move. Um, and uh, and when, I moved, when I moved to San Francisco 20 years ago, I would have been pretty pissed off if someone said, you guys, you know, we get to decide if you move or we all make our own choices. And when, you know, and, and the fact that people are continuing to come here. This, even though we have high housing costs, show that people really want to be here. Uh, and so, so I, you know, people are going to go where they're going to go, and, uh, and and we need to anticipate that, project for it, and plan for it. In terms of the jobs, you see some of that naturally. Frankly, we see some companies that have decided not to expand here because the cost of housing is too high. Their workers can't find a place to live, and so they're expanding elsewhere. Part of that is natural. You know, they're, you're going to have ups and downs of the cycle. Um, but if we get to the point where we are discouraging companies from coming here, expanding here, uh, you may, you know, even though you may think that that sounds good now, in the future, when you have an economy that sort of craters out and it's not a job center anymore, when I, you know, back in, I, when I was deciding whether to move to San Francisco in the, ni the mid-90s, I remember someone saying there, amazing city, uh, it is a tourist town that has no economy left. Mm -hmm. That's what someone right. said to me. Mm -hmm. Well, we now have, we're still a tourist city, and that's great, um, a lot of revenue, uh, a lot of business, uh, but we now have companies that are headquartered, mm -hmm. companies that want to that have come in here or started here and stayed here, uh, and, and that has put a lot of pressure on housing. Um, we haven't built enough housing, uh, but it's created a lot of great things for the city, too. Mm -hmm. and so I. I just personally don't think we should discourage jobs. Can I just qualify yeah. that? Because I'm really concerned about things like the tax breaks we're giving to multi-billion dollar companies that kind of undermine, it switches the whole economy. Pardon me? They're expiring. I don't think they'll be there. Oh, good. Yeah. So, yes. Hi. Um, 